Hello and welcome to another episode of Modular in a Week. Day 6. Today we are going to make uh, noise modules and things related to noise. I choose these two last uh, days, the filters and noise. I was unsure which I should do first, but um, so I chose noise because while testing filters, noise is a very good test source to see that the, what the filter does, uh, even the subtle things. Uh, so starting with noise and today we're going to make a really simple module like super simple and it's just a white noise module it's just one jack out and it's white noise and that's because white noise is just that noise there's nothing you can change or can of course you can you can filter it but that's in a filter module later on so uh, straight out of the module is just white noise there are other colors of noise uh, which we'll probably look at in the next episode um, so this really simple build let's look at that uh, and how to build that. I should say that I did the this was one of the highest um, failure rates of all the modules I did because I got r strange schematics online which didn't uh, didn't work simply. Some of them had tons and tons of of uh, capacitors used in in ladders and and things and in the end it just didn't produce any f sound at all so this really simple module works great and let's look at that so i searched for many and tried many uh, circuits online uh, and finally I found this one on freeenergy.info a white noise generator using avalanche mode biasing uh, made 1997 by Rick Anderson and this is a really simple schematics it uses two 2N3904s two capacitors and two resistors actually three resistors one two three yeah three resistors uh, super simple and if we go into the components list and we go to day 6.1 white noise so this is a really easy build and with its eight components uh, it costs less than two dollars and that's with the jack so really simple and really cheap module and I don't have the build video for this uh, but it took around 20 minutes again it's eight components a really simple build so here's the module in the modular so far it's just one jack and nothing else so I haven't made a panel yet I feel it's a bit superfluous if that's the word uh, to have one jack and just a whole panel for that so I'll probably incorporate that with one of the other uh, noise modules I'll be making and what you hear is what you get this is noise out and this is it nothing more um, and I've done a few patches to show what this can do, what you can use it for. These are just one of two of many things you can do, use it for. So here we have, I, I take the noise signal into the buffered multiple, which goes into both VCAs, which are then open and closed with the, one is open and closed with a LFO, and, one, and this one that you hear is with the AD. So with a really short sound like this, it can be used kind of like a hi-hat, let's say. If we 
raise the decay a bit it's a bit more like a snare maybe and now like a brush or something with long attack and short decay and if we take the longer one with the LFO then we get this more sweeping effect for pads, rain, waves something like that and the two together and when we get the filters into the game that will of course change the sound even more so that is it for this episode. We now have ourselves a very nice noise module which we'll probably incorporate with uh, some other modules in the next episode. Um, there's a lot of projects going on except for the fact that it is soon Christmas. Uh, I did a live video yesterday when I added this uh, shelf here to so I could have my computer keyboard in front of my mixing uh, desk uh, and then my piano keyboard down here um, so this was so I could do that this was in the way before and I couldn't do that so if you are interested in those kind of live videos then you should go and check out my patreon for that and also there is a coming video coming for when I'm making this studio table. Um, as for the modular in a week, we are on day 6, so it's a few more modules this day. And then we have filters on day 7, and then we are... Ne so we're nearing the end of that one as well. Uh, as always, like, subscribe, bell, all that pressing buttons and uh, I guess I'll see you in the next year so I wish you good year or good night take care bye